Hello, Bill Molino here for Bill's Wargame World, and we're in Matthews, Virginia. And this is my back deck of my new home in Virginia. This is going to be our retirement home. And there is the water out to the Chesapeake Bay. Oh my gosh, it's Goober the Traveling Bear. All right, we are down here working, but we'll also be heading over to the Williamsburg Muster. And we'll be doing French Foreign Legionnaire games. But right now, I'm um, just going to give you a snippet of our small, we have a small little house over here, not a little guest house. But I do not own a boat, nor do I plan on really buying a boat. Maybe a small rubber raft to send my wife out into the Chesapeake Bay if she really wants to do some boating. But we have this boat house. Now it's not perfect. Okay, but I think with a little bit of work, um, has big front doors. Let's go inside and I'll show you the, the potential. So, I'm not really sure. Um, I have lighting, but I have yet to figure out how to turn the power on or if the bulbs need to be changed. Um, it's 16 feet wide. All right, concrete floor. Um, and it's got huge doors to bring the boat in but we don't have a boat so we're going to stop the camera here see if we can open these doors all right i got the giant doors open so in the summertime i presume it'll get warm in here um winter time I think a, a simple kerosene style or one radiator heater would work for me. Um, now, storing of figures. There's already shelving to put figures up high. Um, there is a potential of water coming in. And I've been told by the neighbors, you know, most they've gotten is about and the previous owners is about a foot in here. Uh, we are less than 100 feet from the Chesapeake Bay, so part of the living here on the, uh, on the water. So, what do you guys all think, and gals? I know there's a lot of female wargamers anymore, more and more every, every day, with Shelby and Steve, so, I think this has some potential to put, uh, you know, ping pong tables in here, nine by fives, really five feet wide, two of them. And the shelving is reinforced with two by fours. So, and uh, being in my age and all, I don't think I would ever bother doing any kind of uh, insulation in here, but it is uh, pretty darn cool. All right. As all of you know, my wife has had some health issues, and still does. She always wanted to live by the water after her last, uh, last health issue. Um, we bought this so she can live by the water. By the way, uh, she wants me to push back the, uh, the wilderness another 10 feet to enlarge the uh, yard. And here's an angle of the front of the house. So, I have a nice concrete driveway. Um, 
Wow. Everyone, what do you think? Doesn't have to be perfect. And to be honest, where this is, I'm in the middle of no man's land. I don't think I'd get very many war gamers to show up here. But uh, I got a workbench, got cabinets, got shelving. I do have a concrete floor, put some rubber mats down, and I think I'd be in good shape. All right, I have to get back to putting up the pegs for the fence line for the dogs and fix my wheelbarrow, which has a, a flat tire. And then later, the chuckleheads will be here, and we will prepare to go to the Williamsburg muster. And for those of you out there interested, that's the uh, outlet to the Chesapeake Bay. We're near uh, Gloucester, Virginia, if you're wondering. Stay safe, be kind, be courteous, and I hope you'll like my little video of the new war game room.